Hello Twin Flames and welcome to this reading. I'm so excited because my brand new deck of cards, Twin Flame Wisdom Oracle has just come and I'm so excited about this deck. So I'm going to do a deck walkthrough with this and then I'm going to use this in tomorrow's reading. So it comes with a little black bag, so it comes with a little velvet black pouch here so you can put the cards in. And obviously I wanted to do something a bit different with this one because usually they just come wrapped as they are. But because it is a special deck, I thought you may want to keep it in a special back. And, you know, it also keeps them clean and stuff like that. You know, what I tend to do with my cards is put bands on them, you know, so band them all up. But just because it's easy access. But, you know, if you want to look after your cards then it's good to keep them in something like that or even wrap them up in a bit of cloth or you know something you want so I'm going to do a deck walkthrough I just shuffled and one card came straight out so this is also going to be like a little mini reading so you're also going to get guidance from this but this deck right now the Twin Flames Wisdom Oracle is available to buy on Make Plain Cards there is a link to their site in the description box below or from the about page and that'll take you to you know, the website where all of my card decks are. And I have got a brand new Divine Masculine deck that I should receive soon if this one's come too. And, you know, I want to share this with you. So this is a deck where you can receive guidance about what you're going through, about what your masculine is going through and what you're both feeling. So Twin Flame Wisdom Oracle. We've got an owl on the front there, obviously a Divine Feminine in power. And she's got that kind of white hair symbolising wisdom and knowledge and intuition. So this is the card that come out. Look at this for powerful. DF. So what I did with this card, the angels really kind of channeled the messages so clearly. You know, I never thought I'd create a deck with cards like this in it. But you've got the DF, which obviously is a divine feminine. And we've got the energy down here of feminine. So I'll put divine and then F E M I N I N E for the feminine. So the divine feminine is fearless. That's you. You are exciting, especially exciting to your twin. You are magical. You are interesting. You are natural. You are inspiring, nurturing, and you are everlasting. That's you. That's the energy of you. Isn't that powerful? And obviously, we've got this gorgeous kind of sprout, you know, that's coming through. So this is symbolizing, you know, the green finger, which is you have the power as the feminine to create because you are a creator and the nurturing elements of everything within you, that you nurture things the way a gardener would nurture its garden. You make sure that you are sending love out into that seedling that's growing into that beautiful flower or plant and the leaves are blooming so things are growing in your life. So the way that you create power in your life, Divine Family, is by being you. Divine, fearless, exciting, magical, Seeing life as exciting and magical, interesting. Saying to the universe, isn't that interesting? Natural, being yourself. That's how you inspire. That's how you guide and you are everlasting. Very beautiful. So let's get another card. Let's get another card. What else do we need to know? Reunion. Love it. See how the cards are coming out that resonate with where we are now too, even though this is a deck walkthrough. Finding your way back to each other because love always finds a way. And it does. Love always finds a way. Why? Because you are eternal beings. You're everlasting. And the universe creates that way. Very powerful. We've also got the DM. Wow. Divine masculine. So again, divine masculines are misunderstood. Sometimes we don't understand what they're doing. Sometimes they don't understand themselves. So they come across as misunderstood. They are attractive and sexy, aren't they just? They are charismatic and understanding and they are loving and they are important and they are nimble and evolved and they are. And it's about knowing that, that they are very quick in their thinking sometimes. They understand things more than you realise they do. So the divine masculine and the divine feminine are coming back together in reunion. What a powerful message. I should just leave it at that. Let's do some more. What else do we need to know? Here we go. We've got gentleness. Be kinder to yourself because you deserve your love and attention more than anyone else. And that's so true. And I did a reading the other day where for twin flames in communication, be kind. Kindness is the key. 
So be good to yourself and set your intentions. Make yourself the priority by focusing on your goals and your dreams and your plans. So true. Know your worth, self-worth. Use affirmations and positive self-talk to increase your value and the way you see the world and your life will begin to change for the better. And it absolutely will. Self-love. Focus on you and give all of the things, love and attention that you crave from them back to yourself. This way you stop craving from another what is already within and the trigger is healed. These are all messages right now about reunion. Timing. Timelines are guidelines. Trust in divine timing and your union will be on time. And it's on time every time. Connection. You are not alone. Your twin flame lives inside of you. Close your eyes and feel their presence. And find your strength. You are stronger and tougher than anything you are currently facing. This journey in life creates our warrior spirit. Remember who you are and why you have come. Very powerful. And there is more cards, but that's all they're guiding me to share right now. And if you want to get this deck, then it's available on Make Plain Cards. And I am going to be using this deck in tomorrow in Friday's readings. So this is a very powerful deck. Very exciting deck. It tells you exactly what you need to know. And what you need to know right now is the Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine are coming back together in reunion and love. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.